Hidden Object Guru here, back for the big finale of uh, Dark Arta, A Broken Heart's Quest. We're making up for some bad juju we did in our previous life by having our daughter kidnapped and uh, used to resurrect a guy we were responsible for murdering. And now we've made it into the dream world, so hopefully we can finish this thing off. What does it mean, the strange symbols on the hand? Hey, Trung, yes, you missed an amazing game about the moon. I, better, best, I guess I better find a code to... I feel like we've seen some of these symbols before in earlier puzzles. They might be hieroglyphs that are known. I don't have anything. Oh, probably the, uh... Yeah. Jesus, you got a creepy eye, Cyclops. Like, even by Cyclops standards, you got a creepy, creepy eye. Okay, gah! That was louder than I was anticipating. I feel like you go here. And you go here. You know, some Cyclops have a yellow eye. What do you need to know about Stanley? Disc symbols. Oh! Stan Lee showed up in Spider-Man PS4? That's great! I'm very happy to hear that. I'm glad he's still doing cameos. I know he's not... He's not exactly frail right now, but I am trapped, huh? Okay. I was hoping he would show up, but I had no faith that he would. No. Oh, cool. And I just have to click on them? Nice. Uh, let's see. You. Yes, you, you, you. You, yes, you, you, you. I was about to do a quiz about that, uh, but then I realized, again, way too obscure. And I realized as I many as... 15% of my quizzes are about a single TV show that no one who's ever watched one of my streams has ever seen. And that might not be super fair. Yeah, it was nice seeing him in uh, Infinity, War, uh, Infinity War. He's always there, though. It's great. Am I crazy or did Stan Lee... Was he the tutorial voice for a Spider-Man game once? I feel like he might have been. Um, okay, that obviously looks like an angry duck. So I'm happy to click on it. Ducks need respect. PS1, gotcha. No, he's in all of the uh, Marvel Cinematic Universe movies. He's, he's never missed one. Even the Guardians of the Galaxy ones. And he was in the Spider-Man movie, even though it was only tangentially... The question is, will be in the, he be in the Venom movie? Or more importantly, will they manage to get uh, Todd McFarlane to cameo? Creator of Venom. Ugh. That'd be terrible. It's funny. Um, it, apparently 20 years ago today was, the, was Mark McGuire breaking the home run record. Oh. So someone pointed out the amazing story of that, which was Mark McGuire hits his 70th home run. A guy catches in the stands, and, the, and then the, the ball club is like, I don't remember what team he played for. The ball club is like, we would like it back so we could put in our, it in our museum, right? As like the historical thing that happened in our team. We will give you a signed bat, signed jersey, signed ball, and you just give us the 70th home run. And he's like, can Mark McGuire come out and I shake his hand and congratulate him as like, and we get a picture of, like, him, the guy who broke the home record, of me, the guy who caught the ball. And they're like, yeah, Mark McGuire's not going to do that. So he's like, well, screw you then. I'm keeping the ball. He went over, walked straight into Sotheby's. How much can you get this for me? One week later or a month later, Todd McFarlane buys it for $3 million. Wow. Yep. That guy's in the right there. That guy's 100% in the right. He didn't have to give him that ball. He caught a historic ball 
it was 100% his, and he was trying to be, do the right thing to them, and Mark McGuire was a dick. And the answer is, it's because he was so incredibly... He was a rage monster from all the steroids, yeah. is why he was a dick, but he still shouldn't have done that. Yeah. Yes, he technically works for the Watchers. That was a fun cut scene. That was a fun extra scene. Loved that. That was a very good I joke. I don't think Stan Lee's going to do any more cameos. I think I read somewhere that it, it, it's it. Oh, okay. That might be it? Yeah. Okay. Well, apparently he's in the video game. Bunny! Well, he should be. He is. I mean... Um, what is happening here? Uh, no, but look. That's a bunny, right? That's a bunny. That's a bunny. Why don't you try the fox face over there? Okay, I'll try the fox first. Okay, so maybe... Maybe you have to put the face when they're here, at the front. Oh, you have, you have to put it in the front. middle. You can't put it in the side. Okay. Yeah, that's that's fine then. Just wondering what was going on there. Eagle! Goose! Oh, that is a goose. It's a duck. Or it could be a duck. Rooster! Now for Puma! Puma! Seriously, why did we give up on coming up with words other than cub for most animals? Because they're like, oh, a Puma cub. Tiger cub. Like, first off, it should be tiger kitten. Just That's just, come on, obviously. But Puma Cub? That just sounds ridiculous. <laughs> that would be great, Habana. Just to recreate the most humiliating moment of the worst Spider-Man movie. I think people would appreciate that. Which Spider-Man movie? Spider-Man 3. We never watched Spider-Man nope. 3. Nope. There was something about... In, I got a PS4, sorry, PS3, and it came with a copy of Spider-Man 3. So I didn't have to buy it or anything. It just came with it. I didn't, didn't even never put it into the no, machine. No, we, we did put it in the machine. Right, we tried watching the first three minutes, and we were like, nope. nope. We noped right out of that movie. And then, and then, like, what, a few months later, we were in, I want to say, Future Shop, or yeah. one of those electronic stores shopping for, I don't know, a TV or something. And mm. on the TVs, they had playing Spider-Man Spider -Man 3. 3. And it's like, you're never going to sell a TV that way, And buddies. I turned to you and I said, is Spider-Man scat jazzing? Look. Yeah, that was, that was and embarrassing. And you said, yes. What the I think hell? he is. And we had decided that that was the... Are you kidding me? What? I have to find 14 differences between the big and small statues. Well, the shoe is different. Well, yeah, obviously. Pant cuff is half. different. There's three chains on the on there on each side rather than two. That's true. Top one. Okay. Uh, all right, so we've got to. Oh, I can go up, right? Of course. Uh, obviously, the gem, the happy mask, the ring. Not the ring. Okay. What about the grip on the post? No. What about the number of? Oh, hey, these are. Uh, check it out. Oh, damn it, I couldn't... I thought those would be three, but no, they were just one. Yeah. Uh, ah, armlet. Are those called armlets? No, that can't be right. Armband. The, the wings on the... She put the Harry's wings there. All right. The necklace. Yep, the one. two necklaces. We're still missing three, but we're doing well. I'm just saying, we should have gone with Tiger Kitten, Lion Kitten. The gold tip of her spear in the center. Oh, yes. There's a there's a extra thing, colored section. Okay. Thanks, Hans. Uh, okay. All right. No! I was trying to go back down the body, but uh, apparently there's something on the shoulder? 
Oh, yeah, one of the shoulders is bare. Good catch. So I'm checking the arm. Arm's good, hair's good, the hairnet is good, other arm is good. Top is good, necklaces are fine. Wait! Is that bracelet on both sides? It is, okay. Those tails that go down from there. What about this thing here? Is that a, no, that's on both sides. All right, so let's move down the torso. All right, so nothing going on with the front part of the skirting. Is that a hawk sound coming from your headset? Headset, or yeah. Oh, that's okay. the headset. Wait, I never checked the box. No, the box is the same. Aha! We did it, everybody! The final puzzle has been solved. We're gonna finally get the ending we've, uh... Deserved this whole time. Okay. Yes, you will. I know I've said this a bunch when playing this game, but this game is too long. Uh, yeah, no, I'll go find a ladder. Guys, you're... I mean... If... If there's a, uh... Thanks, Hans. I think you spo spotted it a little before we did. But I made the mistake of not looking down. Yay, a wrench! Don't get to say that much. So are there any... Did we find all of the items? No, there's an eagle snake here. And it's literally right there at the middle of the screen. Could not be easier to find. There's only two more, so we are almost finished the game, people. Oh, it's Amiha. Hey, Is Amiha. Amiha. She's still under a curse all this time? Yes. Dear Mary... I'm so sorry about your daughter. Okay. Till my last breath, I will never allow anything to happen to her. Gotcha. This is my fate. Hurry, take your daughter and leave this cursed land. Oh, if only I could save you too. I mean, maybe you can. I don't know why you're just giving up. Oh, hello. Motherhood, true love, humanity. Place the most beautiful flowers in the universe. The powers will be bestowed upon you. The Havan doors will open for the purest. Okay. That sounds doable. Okay. We got demon skulls. We got a trident. We got some flowers hidden away. Is there a new Team Sonic racing game? Or are you talking about an old Team Sonic racing game? Restore the damaged pattern. Done and done. And I mean done. Uh, okay. That's a negatory. Nope. Let's yeah, start in the corners like true puzzle solverators. Um, I'm pretty sure this is that one, isn't it? No, I guess not. Okay, my bad. Um, hmm. Aha! Puzzle! I agree. It is a puzzle. Uh, what have we got here? So we need another thick line going up on the right. Okay. Now we need line going up through the middle. Nope. Aha! This is this is going stellarly. No, not there either. I think there's a middle section that also has a uh, line in it that we don't know about yet. But I could be wrong. Okay. Oh, I keep telling. Yep, see there it is. Yeah. 
Okay, we're done. It's been a fun ride, Puzzle, but you can only delay us for so long. Weird I didn't even have to get any glue or anything to uh, put this thing together. If you're talking about Captain Marvel, then yes. I know everything about Captain Marvel. That uh, sounds like an exaggeration, but I literally know. Like, Which Captain Marvel? The, the, you know, the original Captain Marvel. DC Captain Marvel? Well, Fawcett Comics Captain Marvel. Yeah. Uh, so it's K, so Crescent, U, all. Oh, it's like Krull, but with a Crescent. Yeah, because there's a new mo Captain Marvel movie coming out, Except but they're calling not. it Shazam. Oh, okay. Because there's also a new Captain Marvel movie. It's needlessly right confusing. It's needlessly confusing. No, everyone agrees with you on that one. I'm very excited about it. I once read a story where um, they did a full-on Lovecraftian horror in a uh, Captain Marvel story. It was great. Then another time he battled an insane robot, which uh, was also great. Really, there's there's not a lot of non-great Captain Marvel stories. Oh, uh, the the uh, M Night Shyamalan movie, The Happening, was ripped off of a Captain Marvel story. Oh yeah. Oh. Boom! Flower number one. Possibly unintentionally. Oh, I'm sure it was unintentional. I'm sure he just read it as a kid, and then he ripped it off years later. Like, I don't, I don't think he was out... He's like, oh, I'm gonna screw over Captain Marvel. Like, I don't think he's a... I don't think he's a thief. I just think he's a guy who loved comic books as a kid and then had this idea years later and he didn't realize he was ripping off one of the cops he'd read, uh, comics he'd read as a kid. Because he was a comic book collector. And there's no greater... Uh, um, wait a minute. Like, there's no more obsessive kind of fan than a comic book collector. And they read everything. And, of course, they can't consciously remember every story. But it's all in there somewhere. Because that's how the mind works. Yeah, the Blockbuster stuff got a lot of play on the internet. It was nice that they made a joke about Blockbuster in a Captain Marvel movie. Although, um... Making jokes about, uh... Obsole uh, things becoming obsolescent are never going to age well because you, your film is going to be a forgotten uh, memory one day and then people watch and they're like, wow, they were making fun of something for being out of touch and now this film is uh, completely forgotten. How ironic. Uh, okay. Yes! You're better off sticking to uh, more timeless references. It's not like when they make a movie uh, uh, set in the Old West, everyone keeps talking about President McKinley. I'll be honest with you, I don't remember when McKinley was president. Might not have been during the Old West period. Well, the Old West period does extend. That's uh, Tree, Handcuffs, Y, Harp. Tree handcuffs Y harp. I was thinking earmuffs, but okay. that works too. Tree handcuffs Y harp. Tree handcuffs Y harp. All right, one more of those, and we're good to go. Kite Man is a pretty good character. He's no Rag Man, but he's pretty awesome. Me land, lots of land, meet the stars, skies above. Okay. I will have to also heal flowers. Because heaven forfend anything ever be simple in this game. What up? Trung? I will need a brush. Gotcha. Is this the yellow one? I feel like this might be the yellow one. Yes! No, it's the blue one, dummy. Just because there's gold around it doesn't make it the yellow one. Sophia! Is that her? Sophia! I'm working on it. Uh, no, they haven't sent me a review copy, so I might have to wait until it comes out. Loathe as I am to, uh, wait. I mean, I've played the entire game in, um, uh, in Japanese, of course. Because Fist of the North Star, I wasn't going to wait. Nice. That's hilarious. 
I don't have a brush. You're telling me I'm supposed to do something on this screen, but the only thing to do here is to... Oh, there's a place to click to the right. Alright, I am actually embarrassed now. And the brush is literally right there. Uh, yeah, you fight Jaggy. And you do the Jaggy fight in the game. They wrap up the whole Jaggy storyline. Like, Ray shows up and he wants to kill you, and then his blind Today, sister is there. Ellen, like, it's all in the game. Is all about. All right, what have we got Forgive here? Forgive me, Ananta. We will Aww. never live together a moment. Aww. But believe me, you always lived in my heart. My thoughts. My dreams. Now, my turn has come. Frankly, Oof. I don't know another way to save you now. You are my love, my sunshine, and I shall wait for you in my next life. To that makes perfect sense, and that's more. why he sounded familiar. I still don't know who betrayed us both. Please forget me, and marry Nagin, for she loves you a lot. Oof. Ever yours, Amiha. A sad story this is. Um, yeah. I'm not surprised. He was great. That's a good question. Perhaps you were set up? Uh, maybe not. So we gotta just get some water for the flower. Oh, the Jaggy fight is so much fun in that. I'm not gonna spoil it, but it's an awesome fight. Uh, but yeah, they do the whole story, and then, like, uh... He becomes a... Ray becomes a bandit to look for the guy who, uh... Who defiled his sister. And his blind sister is there. And then they killed Jaggy. And then, yeah, it's just... I mean, it's it's right out of the comic. It's quite wonderful, actually. Yeah, and I'm going to buy that the second I can. The Kazuma Kiryu DLC. I'm just 100% on board for that nonsense. Why do I need axes? Oh, to cut the, the stuff on the door, right. But yeah, I, I hope it's day one DLC so I can play the whole game as Kazuma Kiryu. But, uh, no. I can't use the axes to break the ropes? What is happening here? Fine, I'll, I mean, I'll look at the map, then I'll take a hint, but this is... Oh, so there's stuff to do everywhere that I'm just not seeing, is what you're saying. Fine. Well, there's nothing to do here yet until I find the third wall. Oh, that was dumb. Alright. What do you think there is to do here, game? Oh, I can't get up. You're gonna tell me to use axes to get up there. Sure. Yeah, no, absolutely. That makes 100% sense. I shouldn't have criticized it at all. I think my sarcasm is showing, and if so, I apologize. But yeah, I've got a, a busy old weekend, and then the minute my weekend's over, boom! Fist on the North Star comes out. I'm pretty excited. Okay. So that's dagger, pitchfork, peace sign, scales, that... Wow. This is too long. Thought they'd let me do it like in two phases or something. But no. Too deep to what? I'm just trying to touch it. So I can't use the empty pot? Oh, yeah, that's visibly water right there, guys. Like, that's clearly water right there. I don't have to reach down at all. Your art messed that one up a bit, but whatevs. Uh, no, no, I didn't play all the submissions, because if you don't know Japanese, it's kind of hard to figure out how to start a lot of the submissions. So I didn't get fight uh, the the Amon, Joe Amon, or whoever's in the game. Which I'm sad about, because I always love the Joe Amon fights. The Amon family fights is what I meant to say there. Oh, the chain, right. We just talked about the chain. Nice. Living my dream of having a chain. Totally fine. I don't judge. With wire? Nice.
Why would I not know Ammon? He was in all of the Yakuza games. Hell, I even fought one of them in uh, the zombie game, which is so good. And I hope that gets put on PS4. Uh, let's water some plants, everybody, with magic fantasy water. The best kind of water there is. Water? I keep telling you, it's the best kind of water. Yay, red flower! Time for a yellow flower! And then, obviously at some point I'm going to figure out where the uh, blue thing is. Well, I know where the blue thing is. I mean the wall to unlock the blue thing. da -doy. Okay. Wait. I thought this was the blue flower. No, it's the red flare. It's just got blue glass. Yeah, I know. Yakuza was one of my uh, favorite game stories ever, but the gameplay was a little rough. And then Yakuza 2 had another incredibly good story, but the gameplay was great that time. And then it continued being great for the rest of the series. Oh, here's the wall. Ugh. Are you sure? All right, fine. Maybe here? No. All right, so let's focus on stuff that makes sense. Boop. All right. Perfection. That sounds horrifying, Panda. I need one that goes straight across. Where might that be? Uh, okay. Yes! We've almost got this. So it's not, it has a weirdly large number of super tiny pieces. I'd be annoyed if I wasn't so impressed at their deviousness. I actually am a little annoyed. Uh, that should go right there. Oh, it doesn't go straight across. They're two different pieces. No wonder I couldn't find it. Ugh. That's pretty bad. Oof. That's scary. Well, I gotta say, I only care about Jump Force if it has, uh, Ken in it. So that's, uh, Radish, Half a Ladder, 8, and then Open 8, and then Closed 8. Radish, Half a Ladder, Open 8, Closed 8. Radish, Half a Ladder, Open 8, Closed 8. I know, I agree. Yeah, but if there's no Ken in D Jump Force, who cares? Although I, may, I know it's kind of hard to put Ken in stories like that because he makes people's heads explode. And that doesn't really fit with the vibe for most Jump Force games. Sorry, Jump uh, Shonen Jump characters. So it was the Blue Flower. Now I'm just bonus confused. Yeah, that was the wrong button. Uh, the wrong location is obviously what I meant to say there. Sorry, where were the flowers? <laughs> Oh, they were by her cage. No, they, yeah, they were by her cage. Okay. It's here. There's already a blue flower there. Okay, I just did it backwards. What diagram? Okay. Reset if you go out of the white line. Gotcha. So it's, uh... Gotta be more careful. Come on, Hoguru, you can do it. Almost. No! Oh, this is going badly. We're almost here, people. 
The future is now. Now. I keep telling you that. Oof. I wonder if SNK Heroines is any good. I should read the Game Critics review. It just went up the other day. Well, I think Bandai have been very hit and miss. Because they put out Girls and Panzer this year, so there you go. That game is basically perfect. Alright, good. Clicking on the add button, create a new color seen on the door. Gotcha. Okay, so... Wait, what? Oh, alright. Okay, sure. So you're just testing my knowledge of secondary colors? That's a weird puzzle game. I mean, I'm happy to do it, but it's weird. Excuse me. I apologize for that. A new Samurai Showdown, that's cool. Ha Havan of Resurrection, have you loved anyone more than yourself? Are you that soul of purity? Sacrifice thy life into this Havan, free the dear souls from eternal torment. Curses. Sophia's soul is pure. But what's with the masked man? Why did he kidnap her? To you bring back his wife. That's impossible. Well, you say that, but come on. I just can't catch a break. Whoa, hey! Yeah, no, I know. Which would make this a good time to forgive me, right? Now she can't be resurrected? Whew, we did it! I love that they're pretending there was a mystery about who the masked man was. I mean, as one other character in the game, guys. I was so close after waiting for centuries. Yeah. I can't bear this. Well, the Unreal Engine forever. is gorgeous. So I, I see why they would die, go with it. But I can't. Because you're a god of the snake people? Yeah, that must be rough. Alright. Now we just rescue the daughter, save the day. Bye -bye, Mama. Wait, what are you doing? I'll never see you again. Why? Your little Sophia is going. Forever. No, no, no Sophia, stay away from that cliff. No! Uh oh. Oh, it was just another nightmare. Whew, we did it. Mama. She's still surrounded oh, by blue princess. energy, though, so that's not I good. Let you suffer for my sins. <laughs> I know, right? I can still stay in my Come on! Okay, good. Sanity has found him at last. My daughter is cursed because of my sins. Oh wait, do There's I have to jump off of the thing? To save her. Are you kidding me? My heart is broken. I've destroyed so many lives. Again, that was in a past life, so I have no choice. The curse must You're kidding be broken. Me. Today, I learned what true love is. 
Damn, though. Mama! Don't cry. Mama can't bear it. Mama! Don't leave me! I will be back one day to hug you, my little princess. Oof. I mean, I get it, but oof. Hey, it's those uh floating glow feathers oh, again. Dear. Don't cry. Your mom is not gone. Way to go, Tutti Fruity Interactive. What was the game a little on the long side? Sure. But uh, there's a lot of good stuff in it. And I don't remember this location, which makes me think there's about to be a uh, a bonus chapter, which we're not going to play tonight because I'm not a crazy person. Wow. Yeah, you were a very intense game. Very dramatic. Lots of good puzzles. One or two bad puzzles. And uh, yeah, excellent use of... Indian mythology from some, and that's from someone who knows nothing about it. Just, you know, I guess you were just using the uh, concept of previous life's uh, sins coming back to haunt you. So, still, I was definitely down for this one. I had a great time. Thank you so much for sending it to me, developers. I thought it was a an entertaining ride. And I am totally interested to see what you guys come up with next, because this one is absolutely worth playing my honestly my only complaint and this is such a minor complaint that i would be crazy to uh that i would be uh crazy to object to is it was a little on the long side you probably don't need to be four hour hidden object game like two two and a half is generally the uh the top end you're right this part does look familiar Chinese anime. That wouldn't surprise me. I understand that anime are fairly popular in China, so they would want to cut into that market themselves, rather than just constantly importing culture from Japan, which the Chinese government is not psyched on. Oh, they Big Fish does distributed. Of course they did. Why would they not? Wow. All right. Oh, wow. We can unlock the comic book and just watch the read the comic book version of the story. Aww. Well, that's just neat. Way to go, guys. Uh, so, yeah, we'll be back here next time, obviously, for the uh, chapter. Oh, Sam Nagan. Anyway, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. Thanks for coming along on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more of those buttons for that, questions, suggestions, related whatnot, go in the comments section below the video. If you uh, want to answer the quiz questions, that's where they go there too. If you'd like to be here for the live streams so these games get played, check out the Discord channel. That's where I announce them. And if you were curious about what happens next in the bonus chapter with the Rising Phoenix, the mother comes back. It's a Rising Phoenix. Uh, be weird if that isn't the plot. Join me back here the next item on the playlist. But until then, au revoir.